This video is intended to provide a quick overview of how to manually address the indoor unit using the Vostat 52 P1 handheld controller. Refer to the installation and operations manual found on the Linux VRF app for more details. The use of the Linux wireless handheld remote control is required to manually address the indoor units. We will start by checking that the remote control is in good working order and the screen is clear. Ensure the power supply to both the outdoor unit and the indoor units have been switched on. First, slide the plastic cover down to the bottom of the controller. Then locate the three small holes at the bottom left hand side of the controller. Using a pointed device like a paperclip, press and hold down the lock button for five seconds. The lock button is in the middle of the three holes. The controller will display zero, 00 where the temp set is normally displayed, as this is the first address that is available. Press the main power button once. The addressing icon will display in the top right hand corner of the screen. You are now ready to adjust 00, zero address to the required address number. Press the up arrow key once to increase or press the down arrow key once to decrease. Once the correct address is visible in the wireless controller screen, press the fan speed button while pointing the controller at the indoor unit you wish to address. The indoor unit will beep and display the address that it has received from the controller. Stand as close as possible to each indoor unit when manually addressing. This will avoid other units from being wrongly addressed. The remote control can send commands up to 36 feet away, and due to the wide signal area, units in the same vicinity may receive the signal. Once you have completed addressing all the indoor units, press the lock button until the display returns to normal. Refer to the installation operations manual found on the Linux VRF app for more details.